So Democrats kicking off a new session in Congress with a probe that they believe could possibly lead to impeachment proceedings. After the Mueller probe dead-ended, the focus then, as you remember, turned to racism. And now an oldie is back on the front burner, whether President Trump is profiting off of the presidency. Jason Chaffetz, former Oversight Committee Chairman, Fox News contributor and author of Power Grab, and Basil Smichael is Executive Director of the New York Democratic Party and former aide to Hillary Clinton. So quick question, you know, what are the rules here? So Mike Pence goes, he stays at Dunebag, costs 13000 13, an hour for the plane, and they're saying the president is profiting off that. Is that legal? Is it not legal? Uh, largely untested in the law. The Trump organization is 2-0 and in the courts. Um, yeah. It's a bad look. I would hope that the chief of staff would actually put out a directive and say, nobody can stay at a Trump organization facility if you're in the U.S. government. If you're in a political organization, something else, hey, have but at you it. Say that, but, you know, it's, it's like not in the president's DNA. Once he hears someone's going somewhere, he's like, you have to stay at my place. And he did the same thing with the G7. Do you, but the question is, you know, is he going to profit off it? Is there a way to compartmentalize that and say, you know, this money goes into this fund. You can't touch it till you, you're not president anymore. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know that you can do any of those things, quite frankly. And the way in which some of the money is allocated, I don't know if you want the president going in and saying, put it here, put it here. So, and I know what your tea, in your tees you talked about a lot of things that the Democrats might be doing this for. It's c accountability, by and large. The president is not doing anything that we're used to in terms of political norms. Some people like that. Some folks are very uncomfortable with it. So it's accountability. It's trying to get but to the, the bottom but, of what but remember. Be he should be doing and should be staying away from. But remember, the, the GSA and the Trump Organization came to an agreement where any profit from any foreign entity that stays at a Trump facility is then, that profit is then paid back to the government. I, the, Donald Trump has bent over backwards here. And what is the opportunity cost? Are you kidding me? They want to know how much money you spent at the mini bar uh, at a hotel? That's what Jerry Nadler and Elijah Cummings are worried about? Well, what they're, what, what they're trying to figure out is not just the money, it's the influence. That piece right there is probably the most important. So it's not just them staying at the hotel and paying for the paying for peanuts at the mini bar. It's now are these folks going to going to treat us favorably or not? And is the president Did uh, you have the same questions about untoward. the Clinton Foundation because there are similar issues. Now, I actually did work for the Clinton Foundation and I actually don't believe that the same thing is true here. Number 1 because they weren't in the White House at the time. Number 1. But she was two, Secretary of State. She was Secretary was of State, but if you think about what the Clinton Foundation did, they were actually doing works in other countries like fighting AIDS and HIV. Those are trips that I actually Just went on to do that. Just because you say there are good things. There's a record of it. But the, but this but this is about accountability, right? There's a record of what that money was used for. There's a, there's a record of the medicine and the good works that the staff did on the ground in those countries. But that's why you have and, the uranium and one so, problem that has not right, been but, fully... But, 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 so, let me go back to this. You know, this so what do you think the president... Should, should he not... Should he say, never mind, G7 should not be at the Doral. Put it anywhere you want. I, I just think it's a bad look. Yeah. Just move on. Look, he's given up all his salary. He's losing lots of money by, by doing his government service. Don't stay at a Trump organization f facility. Just don't do it. Stay at the... Radisson or the Marriott or Corporation, at least, <laughs> you know, I mean, dude, he I can, can stay at a Marriott. I can just see Emmanuel Macron at, US the, at the Radisson. Wow. That's going to work. That's going to go over big. A Hampton Inn. A Hampton Inn. I like the Hampton Inn. Exactly. I'm a big fan. Holiday Inn. Uh, thank you, guys. Rest, there right? you go.